my channel. I know it has been a while since I have filmed anything, vlogged anything, um, posted anything. Um, and I thought that today I would sit down and kind of update you guys of what's been going on, where I've been, um, some big changes that have happened. <laughs> Don't mind my dogs. Both of them are in here. Um, and please excuse the mess in the background. It'll kind of make sense after I explain everything. Um, but I am excited that I picked up the camera today. I have definitely been doing some like self-reflecting and listening to some more podcasts and everything and it kind of got me inspired or it did get me inspired to pick the camera up and you know give this another shot um if you know me in person you know that I am very shy um so vlogging and you know picking up the camera can be kind of awkward for me um so but like I said I felt inspired and I heard something in a podcast the other day that was you're never too old to try anything new or you're never and that you're never too old to do something that you absolutely want to do um and that kind of not saying that I am old but it just kind of got me thinking and got me inspired like it doesn't matter what people think it doesn't matter how old I am like if I want to do something I'm going to do it so it got me inspired but I figured that I would sit down and kind of update you guys today. So in me and Chris's lives, there are two uh, big changes that we've had happen um, within the last few months. Um, one of the biggest things that has changed for us is that Chris re-enlisted. Um, so he re-enlisted back, I can't even tell you back in like August, September, when he had gotten home from deployment, he had his reenlistment ceremony and yeah, here we are. Um, so with coming and him, or with him reenlisting comes moving, which is PCSing. And so we PCS, so we no longer live in North Carolina. Uh, we actually moved to Virginia, um, not very far, but we are on a new base. Um, we really enjoy it here. Um, Chris has um, like a, he does, he's doing diff something different than what he was doing on Lejeune. Um, so I mean, it's not very much different, but it's definitely a different pace for him. He's been very busy, and but he enjoys it and we're very happy in Virginia. Uh, we really like Virginia. It's very pretty here. Uh, we love to go on walks and find trails and it's just, it's very pretty here. I definitely miss the beaches in North Carolina, but Virginia is a place that has for sure grown on me. We've been here for about three months and we haven't had any issues. So, and the second thing that is very big in our lives is back in December, um, I, me and Chris found out that we are expecting and that I'm pregnant, or that I am pregnant. Um, I am currently 26 weeks and four days. I had to think about it. Um, so we've obviously known for a while. Uh, we are having a little boy and we are very excited. Um, I'm actually in the baby's room. That is all of his stuff, um, clothes and stuff that we have been given. I'm like, that's his stroller. Um, but all of that back there is just stuff that we have been gifted so far. Um, we haven't had our baby shower yet. That is next week we'll be going back home to Michigan to uh, celebrate our baby shower. Um, and then right next to me I have his crib. Um, and then there's Tank in the background and then Brucey's down, down below. But his room is obviously nowhere near done. We were kind of just waiting, or we were, are waiting for the baby shower um, to see what we all get and then what we need to pick up. So, but we are very excited and that is definitely a big change for us. Um, it was something that was unexpected, but it was a good surprise. So, like I said, we're very excited and that's why we've been, or why I've been MIA a little bit. Okay, sorry, I got a phone call. So, but I can't remember what I was saying. Um, oh, as I was saying, uh, we're very excited um, for the baby and we have not said or announced his name yet so there's that 
but his room is obviously nowhere near done. We're waiting for the baby shower. That was actually my mom that called. Someone had given us more clothes. So we're very excited and we want to see everything that we get before we just need to go out and get some other things. Like I know a lot of the furniture we're going to be getting, but yeah, so we're excited. So that's where we've been. Um, we Life kind of hit us a little unexpectedly with re-enlisting or with Chris re-enlisting and then with the baby. Um, but they're both really good things and we're very excited to be in Virginia and we're very excited to be welcoming a baby in August. So, yeah. But, like I said, I am very excited to be picking up the camera today um, and getting back in the swing of things of vlogging. Um, I definitely want to vlog our... Ex don't mind Bruce if you guys see him. Oh, and there goes Tank. Um, I definitely want to vlog our time in Virginia. Um, I wish I would have done more in North Carolina because we had done we had did so much in North Carolina. Um, so I definitely want to be vlogging more here so I can capture all of our memories. Um, and I have some videos and stuff that I want to do for the baby. So I have some really exciting videos planned that I would like to do. Um, I just gotta stick to it. So. Anyway, sorry, my dogs are probably, uh, doing the most right now. Every time I turn the camera on, they want to act crazy. So, uh, but this video won't be very long. Um, I just wanted to come on and pick up the camera today and kind of explain where we, um, why I haven't been vlogging and everything. So, we wanted to give you guys an update. Um, I do have a couple other things I have to do today. Um, I don't know if I'll vlog it or not. I did... I do have to pick up a Target pickup order, so I might show you guys what I got. I didn't get very many or very exciting things, but yeah. So, if you guys have any questions about PCSing or um, baby stuff, I can do my best to answer those. Um, just comment down below. And if you guys have any videos that you want to be seeing, um, just comment down below or follow me on Instagram and message me on there because I'm more active on Instagram. So I hope you guys enjoyed this part of the video. Okay, so I just got back from picking up my Target haul like I said, or my grocery pickup that I said I would show you guys. I didn't get anything super exciting, um, except for like one item, but it's exciting to me. Um, so I'll show you guys. Um, the only really exciting item that I picked up was a scrub mommy. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen on TikTok, but I just, I wanted one, so I got one, and I'm really excited for it. I like to clean, and I like to post some cleaning videos on my TikTok, so I picked this up just to give it a try. Everyone talks about it, so I got this. Um, I picked up some nail files. Um, my nails are getting really long, or longer than what they normally are since I've been pregnant. And I, since we've moved here, my nail all, I don't even think we brought nail files. I think I threw them all away before we got here. So I picked up some of these because I kept forgetting. Um, I picked up a hole punch, a single hole punch, because if you, we live in base housing, just like we did on, um, in Jacksonville. And if you've lived in base housing, you know that they have like cheap blinds and they break. And Tank and Bruce have broke like four of mine. And instead of having to call maintenance every time, I just take this and I hole punch um, either the other side, like I flip it upside down and do the other side, or then um, I cut the broken piece out and then just hole punch another. Oh, and it works. So, and then I had to pick up some white cardstock um, for the baby shower uh, next weekend. I am making little white onesies for to go on some of the gifts that we're giving out or that my mom is giving out and she asked me to make those. So I had to pick up some more white cardstock. Um, I picked up some milk <laughs> cause we needed milk and we don't have any and I go grocery shopping this weekend but this is just gonna last me through the rest of the week. And then I just picked up some couple frozen things. 
Chris is gonna be working late this not, uh, working late this week. Um, so a lot of the dinners that I have planned are like bigger dinners and made for like more than one person. So I just picked up some lo mein and then some orange chicken. I've never tried these before and they look good for some Chinese as all I've been craving is like Chinese food. So I figured I would try these this week since he will be working late and I just needed a quick and easy dinner. So, but that's all I got at Target and that'll probably be the end of this video because I don't really have anything else going on today. Um, I'm going to fix the blinds <laughs> and do the dishes and that's about it. Other than that, I'll just be hanging out with the dogs and watch some TV and I'll probably edit this video and upload it. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and you guys subscribe for more videos. Um, I'm very excited to be vlogging again. I know I said that, but it truly makes me happy now that I'm not, I'm not working and I'm not really doing anything besides sitting here. So I'm very excited and I hope you guys enjoy the videos and I hope you guys come back for more. So I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.